right, you guys. So if you're new here, my name is Yvette. And just let me give y'all, do not click off because I know how people attention span is this short. Let me just give y'all a little context if you are new here so you can know what's going on. So I moved into this house a year ago. April 1st of last year was when we closed on the house and we moved in. Since we've been in the house, I have did like very minor decorations, like maybe a little decor here and there. Because honestly, you guys, I've been overwhelmed with thinking about, oh my goodness, like I've never had this, this much space to decorate. Like I thought that I was gonna be so excited, but it literally, literally, it overwhelmed me so much that I was like, you know what? As long as I have what I need to have, that's what we gonna have. So I said, okay, Yvette, let me start in each room, like a specific room. Instead of trying to do by this, by that, by that, let me just try to do a room at a time. So I'm gonna start with my master bathroom. As you can see, this is where I'm at. So this video is gonna be three parts. So the first part, I wanna kinda give y'all the inspo that I have in my head, but I want y'all to help me too. Because sometimes y'all know better than me. So I want y'all to help me and let me know what you think I should do. Any suggestions, maybe you have links to certain things where I can go for certain things. Because y'all, I'm like, I don't know about anybody else. But when it comes down to me thinking about decor, I be literally all over the place. So. The first video is going to be pretty much telling y'all the inspo I'm going for, the vibe I'm going for, what I want to do, where I want to put things at, and y'all let me know what y'all think, if I should do something different. Then the second video is going to be us actually shopping for it, and then the third video is going to be decorating. I didn't want to put it all in one video because I didn't want it to be too long. So let's go ahead and get started, shall we? This is going to be vlog style, so don't think it's going to be too professional, okay? <laughs> okay. All right, so I'm holding the tripod. I'm gonna try to be as steady as possible, you guys, because I know how it is when it's shaky footage. It's like, whoa, we're on a roller coaster. So I'm gonna try to be as steady as possible, but this is the entryway, as you can see, to the bathroom. And one thing about our bathroom, it when I when we first when the house was getting built, one thing I said was like, dang, the bathroom is like narrow. Um, so I wish it was kind of more wider, but you know, I'm grateful it gets the job done. It's still a beautiful bathroom. So as you can see, it's not like a whole tour. You can kind of see what's going on. We have the double sinks. This is his side. <laughs> he has nothing. That is my side over there. And then we have our own individual cabinets and then we have three drawers in the middle. And then right here we have the bathtub, which it also has a shower head, but it's the bathtub. As you can see, we have um, some baby things right there because we use this bathtub to bathe the twins. Also, if you don't know, I have twins, you guys, if you're new here. So this is the bathtub and this is the shower. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And then this is the toilet room. Literally nothing here. Toilet, okay? So let me also tell y'all one thing else. Something that is so dumb about our bathroom, right? When they were built in this house, I was like, why do they not have a linen closet? So we do technically have a linen closet, but the linen closet is in our room, which I don't like because anytime we have guests or the kids need to come get a towel, they have to come in our room and I don't like that. So in our room, we actually have a closet right here and it looks very narrow and skinny, but when you open it up, it's a bit more wider and there's no type of organization in here. I mean, at the top we have cleaning supplies, then we have an iron here, a couple of candles, then we have just microfiber, like just cleaning cloths, blankets, towels, just miscellaneous things. So I definitely want to, I definitely want to organize this. I've been looking at different things on Pinterest for a little inspo, but I need y'all help, okay? So we have this closet right here, right? But also in the toilet room, we have another closet. As you can see, the closet in here is not even like, it's no type of organization to this either. Um, we have feminine items, toilet paper, a shower curtain that's all bought up. You know what I'm saying? It's just no type of organization. But what I'm so confused about is where should I put what? Like, for example, 
it's like I was thinking about okay maybe I could put like extra of course the toilet paper can go in here because this is the toilet room and you know feminine items you know that can go in here but I'm just so confused on if I should include like the towels in here or if I should include the towels in the other closet because it's like it would be easier for us to be able to grab the towels from the from the first closet that's out there and then and then you know just hop in the shower versus having to come in here open you know the toilet room door and then come in here open this door you know it just would be more convenient but it's so much shelf space in here that I'm like well I definitely want to utilize this so I don't know what to utilize it for and I'm just I'm so confused y'all I don't know why they didn't just put the linen closet in the hallway like that's all y'all had to do okay anyway as far as the inspo on what I want to do in here so I do want it to be an aesthetically pleasing bathroom but I do want it to be functional aesthetic okay so on his side I'm not even sure what to put I did want to put some affirmation cards here for him to look at daily um of course some soap we did have like two hand soaps but <laughs> mine ran out so I took his and <laughs> As you can see, I have a face towel holder. He does not. And then in the middle, I was thinking about doing some type of um, like a marble plate. And then on the marble plate, I don't know if y'all seen on TikTok. I'll try to insert the video of where they have like, I'm guessing there were technically soap dispensers, but you could put toothpaste in it and Listerine but you being that the toothpaste is so thick you just mix a little bit of Listerine in there and then it comes out um a better consistency so I wanted to get two of those containers and put it on top of the marble plate I always love to have a candle in here no matter what so that's what I wanted to do in this area right here maybe a little plant a little something cute you know I don't know y'all so over here on my side, I have my affirmation cards. I really don't even like having the affirmation cards right here because I like to take one out, you know, leave it there. But when I wash my hands or whatever, water splashes and it gets it wet. So yeah, this might not be the most ideal place. Or maybe I could put the affirmation cards in the middle and have one just laid out so me and him both can see it um right here this is i had uh i got a click toothbrush and it, this is a magnetic holder i don't even use the toothbrush anymore so i have to figure out how to get this off because this is like stuck like and i don't want to break the glass like it's stuck so i have to figure that out of course i can put a face towel right here but i really don't even use towels for my face because it's unsanitary also this you guys face pads don't even use face pads why are they there so I definitely want to change a container this container out for um a acrylic container for face towel like face paper towels um because I definitely be needing that when I'm washing my face and then I have my little essentials over here my moisturizer my cleanser scalp oil different things like that a little bit of perfume so what I'm thinking for this side on my side I do want to have I don't know if y'all see like those little maybe sometimes they're marble it could be like a little shell bowl where you could just put your earrings or you could put your uh, rings anything like or necklaces any type of jewelry that you might want to take off jewelry on my nightstand and the twins always get to it and then it'll be on the floor and then it be gone so <laughs> I definitely want to have that I do want to have a stand to where I can put my facial cleanser and put my moisturizer and have something just a little bit cute maybe like a corner shelf right here you know and I don't know like what should I do with this you guys because I don't want to have a towel here I don't use it it's unnecessary I really don't want to take it off because then it's gonna be a hole so what should I do and also I was thinking about in our I'm trying I try to think of little things that I be needing that I don't have so one thing I know I need is when I wash my face and I use a paper towel I don't have anywhere to throw the paper towel other than in the trash can right there so I was thinking about 
it's junky under here right now but i was thinking about getting a little trash can to put under here so i could just bloop and put it on his side also that will work and then i definitely want to organize these drawers you guys like y'all literally junk just junk drawers i mean it's not junk we use it but it's just like as you can see the bottles they were standing up but they spilled over because you know open open you know what i'm saying so i need some type of functionality so it can look good and not be messy like this i love how deep our drawers are i don't know if y'all could tell but it's deep i mean as you can see i can stand this entire canister up and close it but it definitely needs to have some type of storage to where it can stay in place as far as also i was thinking about using that bottom drawer as a storage place for the twins um toys and stuff like that because baby they're not part of the aesthetic however they need that stuff so i can't get rid of it so i was thinking about using the bottom drawer as a place to where i can put their little toys and put their uh baby wash and whatever they may need just store it there so you know i we could just grab it and then it'll be there as far as the tub i mean it's really not much that i want to have right here but i do i was thinking like since this little corner area since this corner area it's kind it has a good depth to it depth to it so maybe a plant right there something right there to make it look cute now as far as the shower area i don't know if y'all been seeing it i'm sure y'all have because who haven't the eucalyptus plants that people have hanging from their shower head i was thinking about getting that because i kind of like how that looks. i don't know how he's gonna feel about it he'll be like so <laughs> that's what i was thinking about as far as that um and i want to make this area look more cuter like as you can see the bottles the soap it's just it's not giving what it's supposed to give the rags like it's just i mean you know it's a shower you guys i'm not really I'm, i want to use it for its purpose so as far as the rags being there i mean they're rags you know what i'm saying you got to wash your tail but you know i just want it to look cuter also i don't know if y'all ever seen a bathroom where it just have way too many mats like it'd be a mat here a mat there a mat there a mat there a mat for the toilet i'm not trying to have all of that I would love for our feet to be able to be warm in the morning time when we're brushing our teeth or when we're washing our face, but it's not necessary. So I'm good with just having a mat in front of the shower, being that that's what we utilize the most. However, I do want to get a new mat. Um, I've been looking at different options, so I'll pop up on the screen one that I saw. But let, sh let me know which color I should get you guys because they have different ones. They have one that's like a bluish color. Then they have a grayish color and then they have a greenish color. So what I was thinking was to add some type of color to this room. I can get the green mat and then it will kind of go with the eucalyptus plant. What do you think? <laughs> then for this bathroom, I mean, y'all, the purpose is to use it. Okay. So of course i can make it look cute i've seen some things on pinterest to where you can have like different shelves a shelving unit a little decor maybe some perfume i mean not perfume um fragrance spray bath whatever it's called for real something you know so yeah i mean it's not like it's not the biggest area but it's not too small either i definitely want to get a new trash can because i don't know if you could tell but the trash can has a crack in it also right here i want this is by the shower by the way i want to put a towel hook because right now the only place that we have to put our towel is you know just to lay it on top of the counter and we grab it when we get out or we have towel we have towel holders on the back of the door it doesn't make sense to come out of the shower then walk over here and get the floor wet and grab the towel so i want to have a towel hook so that when we're getting out the shower, I mean, when we're getting in the shower, we could just bloop. And then when we get out the shower, bloop. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Also, I was thinking about getting one of those little squeegee wipes. Because I don't know if you could tell, but the soap scum on our shower. And y'all, I clean this. So, it's, it just gets annoying. So, we definitely need space for that. So... I don't want to do too much, you guys, because we don't have that much room in here. But I definitely want it to be cute to where when we walk in here, it's like, 
Oh, good morning. Oh my goodness, I'm so grateful. I mean, I'm grateful either way, but you know. So let me know what you guys think. I gotta figure out what he gonna have over here. I'm gonna have to ask him or something. Cause like this, you have nothing, nothing. Y'all help me, okay, help your girl. The next video is gonna go up on Sunday, which I don't know what the day is, but you should be watching this on a Wednesday. The next video is gonna go up Sunday where, where we're gonna do the shopping. So make sure you leave a comment. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you like my ideas. Send me some links or suggestions or something. Alexa, Alexa, stop, stop. Send me some suggestions or something, okay? Cause I need the help and we gonna do this together, me and you. Me and you, it's just you and us, me and you, okay? So I love you guys, I will see you all in the next video. I'm sorry I went in my A. I just been, you know, I haven't even been going through a lot. I just, it's for good purposes, I'll say that. So I'll see you guys in my next video. Woo!